temperatures and the wind chill have not made the morning any easier for Milwaukee firefighters. WISN 12 News' Hillary Mintz continues our team coverage live from Milwaukee's north side, where fire crews spent a long night in the cold braving the elements. It was a long and cold night, Melinda. We're here at Richards and Keefe. And you know, it's one thing to be standing out here like I'm doing for just about five minutes, but crews were fighting a fire in this home behind me here for nearly four hours. And they say that, you know, working in these elements just is a, makes a tough job even tougher. Now, the fire broke out in the home around midnight, and you can see the flames there just ripping through the house. You can see that through the window. That gives you an idea of what they were dealing with. And we're told five people who live in this home, they did make it out safely. The fire department says that when it gets to certain temperatures like this and the wind chill, uh, like it was this morning. They bring in an extra engine and a private ambulance to help them out. Crews also rotate and warm up in the rigs, but overall, they say sometimes when you've done all you can, the temperatures still present some big challenges. Water freezes, uh, hydrants are a concern. A lot of times the hydrants don't work very well. It's hard for our lines not to freeze up. It's very difficult on our personnel as well as on our equipment. Our breathing equipment freezes up. And one thing uh, that battalion chief says he also tells his crews you might not think about in these cold temperatures is to hydrate. Just like you would when it's really hot, crews also uh, strongly encouraged to drink a lot of water when they are out here in these conditions. But no one was hurt, and that's really the good news out here at Richards and Keith. For now, we are live on the north side. I'm Hillary Mintz, WISN 12 News this morning.